And welcome back, lovely, amazing video game type people. We're going to do a shorter episode this time. Let's get right into it. Uh, we'll go right ahead with our initial plan. What are we going to give them? Uh, a hatchet to the head. We can use it to chop furniture. Oh, people. No, I really enjoyed the, uh, the knife. The military with a good rate of fire. Ooh. Powerful weapon for short distances. I don't mind the shotgun. It's definitely a nice old thing. So let's go ahead and do that. Knife, shotgun, and a crowbar. <laughs> Alright. That seems reasonable. Now remember, we're looking for, first and foremost, for food, for materials, probably also uh, mostly for food. We'll do what it takes. We'll do whatever it takes. Can't still be alive, can they? It's all about. Oh, somebody's injured. There. There's a fridge. I'm going for the fridge. Nobody cares that we're stealing, buddy. Oh, yes. Food. So much food. Loving it. Uh. Go, go, go. We're going to try to not kill them. Shit. That would make way too much noise. Oh shit. Sounds to me... Like we might be in trouble. Go for it. Do it up, do it up, do it up. Do it faster, do it faster, buddy. Hurry. Take the books and the bullets. Oh God! Climb, climb, climb! Stay safe, stay safe. Whatever you do, stay safe. Uh, weapons parts. We've gotten some food. So that's really well played. Um, materials is something that we'll probably end up needing. Book it. Do it.
How many more people can there be? Oh. Just mice. Okay. Well, shoot. Probably got all the good stuff. Didn't kill anyone today, so that's good. They've learned their lesson, I think. Uh, Bob was awesome. They're not trying to shoot me, are they? You know, they've really learned their place. <laughs> Good. Okay. No, no, I'm just looking for materials. The crude letters on the wall reads, Hannah, Thomas and we moved into the, in with Uncle Radu. We buried Mom in the yard. Take care, Daddy. Petra. That sucks. That's dark. Ugh. Oh, I know this game is supposed to be dark still. Ooh, that's that's handy. What's down here? Can we leave on this side of things? Yeah, I hope so. Cool. What? No more books for me? <sighs> Alright, forget the quality roll up. I don't know. I don't know. I'm running out of time. Part of me still wants more materials or food or something. Ah. You know what? Forget it. Forget it. We're we're going home. This is a very awkward collection of things. But we got some food. Oh. Didn't have to kill anybody either. Lots of weapons parts, some food, some Lots of random messed up stuff. We really need to go and collect more materials again. How are things back home? We've been raided. It was a band of hardened robbers, but we managed to fend them off. We had some weapons, but not enough for everyone. Bruno was wounded, but the attackers didn't steal anything. We were able to defend ourselves. Shoot. Everybody's got to stop getting wounded. Uh, let's pick up on some news. Coffee is becoming less and less available in the besieged city of Pogrom. The price of coffee on the black markets are expected to rise. As if war wasn't enough, crime is on the rise in the city of Pogrom. There are reports of armed assaults and robberies. Okay. Okay, that seems... Uh, Reasonable, I suppose. Go chop that thing up. Um, I wouldn't mind if everyone went and got some sleep. Make a filter, maybe. I don't know. Uh, filter. I don't think we're ever going to have problems with wood and food again. All this stuff we're chopping up.
Man, everybody's kind of slightly wounded. They really need to rest. And eat and all that. So... Specifically, Pavla needs to rest. Thing, apparently. We've got no materials. <sighs> we really could use a helmet. Saw blade. Yeah, potentially. get to otherwise inaccessible places. Alright, I'll think about it. Who's this? Uh, he needs help. Ooh, we could make moonshine. Alright, what do you need help with, buddy? Hello again. Please have a heart. How are you doing? Thanks to your help, all the wounded recovered and went back to their homes. One of them still needs bandages though, and I've run out. Could you spare any? Sorry, I, I uh, I don't have any bandages. We don't have any bandages. What more do you want from me? Um, moonshine. Might as well make some. Yeah, yeah, make some water. Some water, some moonshine. Veggies. Sounds great. Let's do it. Bruno's the best. I like Bruno. Slightly sick, slightly wounded. Once you're done cooking, have a meal. Have a meal. That will do for now. Take your meds. Content, tired, hungry. And go have a meal. Recovering. Yes, we'll let us keep it warm here, don't worry. Alright, what is it that we need? What is it that we need? Okay, traps for small animals. I like the idea of some traps. For some small animals. I really do. That actually looks fun too, an armchair. But back to traps and animals. Um, we're gonna need a lot more of those parts. Okay, parts and materials. If we can just get parts and materials on the next run, we'll have some traps ready. In the meanwhile, an armchair would be kind of nice.
Not quite sure where, but it would be. Items? No, I suppose not, hey. We got our fridge there, we got a chair there. Our chair upstairs. Um I'm not sure. I like that idea. But then again, the armchair would make so much more sense. So much more sense in a place with bright light for reading, you know? Uh, we'll keep it down there. Oh, I suppose I should have used the handyman to build the armchair. Oh, I'm an idiot. We'll make alcohol next time. How's that for you, buddy? Bet you like that, don't you? Got a nice little armchair going. What do we have to say? Our shelter feels almost like home, giving us relief and helping us regain composure. We lack cigarettes. We have a chair and an armchair. We have beds and we sleep in decent conditions. If someone gets sick or wounded, they'll have a place to rest. We've made a radio and we like listening to it. We're glad to have some books. Reading helps fighting the wars of war. Staying here provides some comfort in these hard times. Nice. Alright, Pablo's gonna make a run so that we can make some animal cages. So that we can get some food. Meanwhile, everyone else is gonna be recovering. Uh, Pablo's run, we just need materials and more materials. So, with that in mind, almost anywhere feels like it would be good. Almost anywhere. The supermarket seemed like a nice enough place. Huge amounts of weapons, parts, meds, materials, food. Yeah, let's keep going to the supermarket. Um, send Pavle, please. Sleep in bed. I don't want everybody sleeping in bed. Slightly sick, slightly wounded. I wouldn't mind. Maybe two of them guarding. Hunger, slightly wounded. Hungry. Idiot, you should have eaten. Alright, for some reason we're going to let Katja sleep, and Pavle is going to go scavenge at the supermarket. Let's prepare for supermarket scavenging. Now remember, we're looking for materials and parts, or components and parts, are the two things we're looking for. Uh, I feel like taking a knife is not a bad idea. Always. Always take a knife. Or maybe not, I don't know. Maybe there's nobody left. Okay, we'll assume there's no one left. So we won't take a knife. We'll just take a crowbar. And we'll go at her. Crowbar should be able to open things for us. Maybe, hopefully, fingers crossed. I really do want to take a knife. Urgh. Just in case. Just in case something new happens. Okay, we'll try it. Oh, who is that? Hey there. What do you try to do? Good thing the girl is safe now. 
Yeah, good thing. Wow, everybody heard about it. Cool. Let's do it. That's what I want. There's stuff in there and I want it. I know you don't have a shovel, but I think you've got enough time, Pablo. We're going to go as far through here as we can. Are you, anyways? She lives next door. Helps me with the groceries sometimes. Cool. What, are you going to give me a reward or something? I don't want to think what would have happened if this soldier hadn't been stopped. Yeah, she would have gotten awfully, awfully damaged. You're welcome. Good, I'm, I'm glad to hear that her family's taking care of her. Do you want to help with this? Maybe? No, I guess not? Okay. <laughs> the military can't do what they want with impunity. That's true, too. Silly military. They're almost like, they're almost like the police officers nowadays in our world. People still have the strength to fight back. That's right, they do. What do we get? Band- Oh my! Damaged helmet, broken guitar, broken shotgun. Take it all. That was beautiful. What else are we looking for? Apparently coffee's going up. Take some of that. This is not at all the kind of haul I was hoping for. Don't mind me. Okay. I won't. Crazy person. Wow. Alright. What do we got? Nothing useful. I'll probably get rid of the cigs and the coffee. Because I do want more materials and other stuff. That was just legitimately a thing that we needed. What's in here? Booze. What's it going to be? Ooh. Herbs. Nothing good. Alright, so... Let's drop some of the stuff we don't need. I definitely want the damaged helmet. Um, the coffee we can forget about. The cigarettes we can forget about. Uh, that crowbar maybe, I don't know. We're definitely keeping the broken guitar, the damaged helmet, and the broken shotgun. What I still want though, is that. Vegetables, hey. That's tempting. Very tempting. We'll leave them for now and we'll remember that there are vegetables down here. We need a little bit more parts though. So we'll have to scrap the moonshine for more parts. anything under the bed, is there? Ooh, yeah! More vegetables and mad ingredients and actual herbal medicines. you fools. Wait, try that. Oh, okay, or don't. There's nothing up there, hey? Is this where she sleeps? <sighs> well, at least we got a damaged helmet. All 
Alright. Forget about the moonshine for now. And get some more parts. Can we get two more? What's up here? A faded leaflet with skull and crossbones reads, Danger! Do not touch unexploded ammunition. Any weapons, ammunition, or equipment left behind or unexploded may be booby-trapped. Do not touch anything. Do not risk severe injury or death. Report any such finds to the nearest army outpost. Uh oh. Okay. Now I think I think that's actually a thing. Somebody mentioned on one of the forums that I was reading that something that sounded like it was a booby trapped gun that they tried to pick up and then they got killed. So I won't pick up booby trapped guns. Instead, I will stick with not booby trap guns. I give me one more part some. It's better to just take guns from people you kill. So I figure anyhow. Come on, give me that last part. Girl, thanks, man. Didn't think he'd actually do it. Cool. I know you don't want any trouble. Neither do I, neither do I. Let's see how we did. Maybe I shouldn't have taken the knife. Day 11, outbreak of crime. Well, that's not good. <laughs> it's not good at all. Look, I've got the bandages. Let's dress that wound. The night was calm. Everyone should be happy. Alright. Bruno, starters. Cook something, man. Bruno's gonna cook something. Uh, Pavle, get yourself to bed. Marin. Yeah, do it up. Marin, you old handyman. What you doing? Uh, hungry, slightly wounded, tired. No, 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 no. I'm sorry, Marin. This is what you're doing. You, friend. Yeah. I'm gonna make some traps for small animals. One trap for small animals will be made. I'm down. I am so down. Where would one naturally keep such a thing? One trap for small animals. <laughs> Down in the basement? Ew. It's pretty gross. Um, I don't mind the idea of keeping these up here. Let's just place one right there. Cool, thanks, man. Bro, stop lagging around. I'll gladly eat something. Do it. Gotcha. Hungry, slightly wounded, content. Bruno slightly wounded. Marin must be. Oh, everyone's just slightly wounded. Slightly wounded and tired. Get to sleep, buddy. Hungry and tired. Uh huh. If you're hungry. Oh. We'll get two for one kind of deal. What's that? Oh. Raw food. Wait, so we. Oh, that's awkward. Fertilizer. Where would one get fertilizer on a regular basis? We 
definitely gonna need more food. Using fertilizer, we can grow some herbs here and use them to make medication or cheap cigarettes. Where does one get fertilizer, though? How do you get fertilizer? Table with some simple equipment where we can prepare herbal meds, bandages, and low-quality roll-up cigarettes. Apparently, I'll just have to find fertilizer. Unfortunate, really. A bed. A fourth bed. Might as well. <laughs> Might as well, hey? So that everyone can rest. That's actually not going to stop me from doing the other thing. Hopefully. Will it? Oh god. The helmet. Go make the helmet, man. I totally forgot about the helmet. Yes! Just barely, eh? Look at that. Yeah, okay, we're gonna make a helmet. Once the helmet's done, he can go lie down. Probably go eat. Alright. Nice! You can still repair the shotgun, hey? Go ahead. Feels better. Probably just looking great. Go uh, have a sit down or something, friend. And uh, Marin can finally lay down for some snooze. Slightly wounded, recovering. Slightly wounded, recovering. Hungry, content. I know you wish you had some coffee. I do too. Anyways, I feel pretty good about uh, about most things. Slightly wounded, recovering. Slightly wounded, recovering. Slightly wounded, recovering. Content. Nice. Everyone's doing pretty good. So here's what I'm thinking we're going to do. Next, I want to build that herbal garden. See how that does. Maybe grab some fertilizer out there. And see if we can't stay alive with some more food. Really, part of me doesn't think there's that much more food left at the supermarket. We might want to scavenge elsewhere. <laughs> Pavle just sitting there. You might as well listen to the radio. See if they have any good old suggestions. Crime is on the rise in the city. Most of us can't imagine starting a day without a cup of coffee, and Pagoran has become an almost unavailable commodity. The prices skyrocketed, and speculators are the ones who profit. Uh -huh. It's cool outside.
Lovely. Alright, what are we looking at here? Now, it's, there's a crime spree on. Slightly wounded, slightly wounded, tired, slightly wounded, content. Alright, Marin gets to sleep in bed. Um, you two get to stay up and guard. And Pavle gets to scavenge. Uh... A small yet luxurious hotel previously owned by Pagoran Travel Agency. Presently occupied by some armed thugs. Screams are sometimes heard coming from the building. It's best to keep away from it. Well, it does say it's best to keep away from it. Huge amounts of food. Looks like it's a great place. Small apartment building. Wait, hold on. Caution advised. Danger. We should be careful. Okay, well, that sounds less terrifying then. Shelled school. Danger. Possible trade. City hospital. Let's try the hotel. Hmm. I say the hotel sounds nice. Okay. be occupied, so probably only have one lockpick. Um, a knife. Just in case. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to do more of a scouting run this time. I don't actually want to get involved in any fighting. So... The knife should be enough. The knife and a lockpick, and we'll just see what we can get. I'm sure we'll get something. Um, gosh, I don't know. Maybe a shotgun. Just in case. Ugh. Okay. Seems risky. I don't know. I mean, that's gonna that's gonna let us take a lot less things. Maybe if there is a good haul of stuff, I'll probably end up using that lockpick anyways. If not, I'll just throw it away. I guess. Let's give it a go. Ugh. I have mixed emotions about this. I don't know. I don't really want a gun. And yet, who knows? Probably shouldn't have taken the gun. Once noble and bright, now a shadow of its former self like us. I want to make a shovel one of these days. a place to kill someone if it has to happen these bodies they are horribly mangled these wounds were inflicted with extreme cruelty whoever did this must have been a deranged psychopath oh good there's a deranged psychopath in the hotel because that's exactly what I wanted to hear oh that is so not okay deranged psychopath in the hotel Oh, good. God won't help you here. And I'll gouge your eyes if you don't shut up. Shit. Did 
but I just... You freak! You sick freak! You sick, sick freak. fighting. I think Pavla just killed everyone. There's a note scrapped down. Every night I hear screams. I can't take it much longer. I dread the moment when they come for me. God save me, please. I just saved that guy's life! You're welcome! What the hell did you... Where are you going? Whatever, we gotta look through those bodies of the people we killed. I feel like we just killed a lot of people. I don't know if he's going to be okay with it. What just happened? What just happened? Alright. We got our ammo back, so that's nice. Herbal meds. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, nothing that great. Food is what we need. Let's find some, okay? Now that we've killed them all. Oh, look at that. That is awesome. Sorry about what happened in here, guys. It's just a matter of the course. That would be nice, actually. Scrap that knife. And take two more parts. Take some fertilizer. Food. That's so juicy. I'm not leaving food. After realizing how much we need it. I'd have to be crazy. What was that all about? Door is locked. Woohoo! More food, some drugs. Oh man. Okay. Take them. Take the drugs. Look at all that materials. 
It's beautiful. What does this one have? Oh, just a knife. Where's the other one? I swear there was another one that I shot. No? Okay. Run to the exit. Run to the exit. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Love how fast you can run. You rock. Don't ever change. Please don't get too depressed. They were coming to kill you. Day 12. Alright, he didn't look depressed. He looks okay. I got the medicine. I hope it'll help. Alright, he looks fine. We've been raided. Of course we have. Ammunition we used to chase them off. Okay. Someone tried to They came in for some arm, but we managed to find them off. Thankfully, we were all alarmed. None of us were wounded, and the attackers didn't see anything. We are able to defend ourselves. It seems that Bruno is starting to feel a bit unwell. Damn it. Slightly sick, slightly wounded, and tired. And hungry. Oh, good. Alright, well, how about this? Everyone just freaking eat. Damn psychos. Fortunately, Pablo was able to release that man. Yeah, that should make you all happy. I don't know where I found that courage. Sometimes war brings out the best in people. Slightly sick and slightly wounded. Yeah, the herbal mats, bud. Go sleep it off. Uh, slightly wounded, content, and tired. Sleep it off. Content and tired. Go sleep it off. I want everybody sleeping. Except maybe before you sleep it off, bud. Check something out for me, man. Herbal workshop. I think we could actually build a herbal workshop today. So. Maybe I will go with that. Ooh. A guitar. Oh, we can make the guitar. Alright, go to sleep. We'll have Marin make that guitar for us. Well, it's either the guitar or the herbal workshop. Oh, open up, I brought something for barter. Alright, gotcha. Get your ass over there. Bio. I'm sure Pavle risked helping that hostage for a good reason. Slightly wounded. Alright, trader man. Show me what you wish to trade. Tell you what. I've got some nice things. Things are getting crazy. I will give you a shotgun. Okay? I'm going to give you a shotgun. And in exchange, you're going to give us lots of good things. What comes the question? Well, food for starters. Food's a good place to start. Uh... Really? That's it? For a shotgun? That blows my mind. Whoa, buddy. Franco, you are trying to rip me off, aren't you? Hmm. It won't do. Try 
try harder. What? Fine, screw you. I'm keeping the books. Shotgun with five ammo. That's awful. I'm keeping my ammo. Son of a gun. There go our herbs. There you go, herbal meds. How's that for fun? Tool. <sighs> that ought to do. We're getting a bunch of materials out of it. I mean, I don't know. The specifics might be nicer. Some coffee, some cigarettes. More bandages. Oh. But no, you're right. The food will help. The food will help. So you've got yourself an awkward deal. I'm going to begrudge this to you. I hope you know that. No. Bye, buddy. Wait, you closed it on the wrong side. Get inside, you crazy woman. Slightly wounded, content, and tired. Get to bed. workshop for one more piece of wood. Might as well. That'll at least tell us what we can make. any critters, are we? What's this one? Oh. An advanced metal workshop will require a mixer. Um. Oh, okay. The advanced workshop. Well, it looks good, doesn't it? It looks good. Give that a try. I know where you found that courage. I wonder if that's going to come back to help us somehow. Oh, it does not look great. Alcohol distiller. Pure high quality alcohol. Ooh. Stone to make the guitar. What's this? Reinforced door. Once we board up holes in windows in the shelter, we can think of reinforcing door and installing a simple alarm system. Absolutely. Absolutely we're gonna do that. We need a little bit more wood, one more electronics. Yeah. Yeah, okay, we're gonna do the reinforced door. That sounds amazing. Other heat lamp mixer and a thermal regulator. Uh what is that? Required for that? Yeah, that is, okay. Anything new for the workshops? Not really, no. Okay. Still gonna wanna make that guitar. But the next thing that I think we're gonna need is that reinforced door. Absolutely. So, we'll get a bunch more materials. Let's see if we can chop any more wood down. Is there anything left to chop? No, we've run out of wood. A 
Come in. Go recover. That sucks. Okay. Nothing left to chop for wood. How does Pablo feel? Our community doesn't need deranged criminals. I let them know we're vigilant. <laughs> yeah, you did. You killed them. <laughs> you let them know we're vigilant. I like it. Nice way to call it. Okay, so we're going to need more wood. A lot more wood, actually. We're going to need... What is that? Uh, eight. Eight more wood? I'm going to call the episode, I think, before the... Uh, at the end of the thing. 15, 6. So we're like 9 more wood. 10 more wood then. And holy cow, a lot of more of that. And a little bit of electric parts for that reinforced door. That should help us fight things off. I don't know if we actually do need water. Do we need water? How much do we oh yeah, we might we might want to grab some water. We're doing pretty good. Pavle has learned the finer arts of killing people. Yeah, I'd say we're doing awesome. At least it's warm. the night. Okay. Okay, so you get to guard. You get to guard. You get to guard. Just have everybody guard. Why not? And have Pavla scavenge. I think we can scavenge the hotel. I don't think it's dangerous. We killed them all. Um, and there's lots of useful things. So we're going to do that. We're just going to scavenge the hotel a couple days in a row. Uh, use the crowbar for sure. For sure, for sure. I don't think he needs anything else. I really don't think he does. Yeah, we're going to make a great run. Yeah! Let's book it, old pal. Right. Up, up, and up. Done. We've got the wood we need. Reinforced door. Yeah, there's really nothing. Nothing, hey? That was lots of good uh, resources there, if I remember. Private property, my ass. Take that one more wood, please. That's what we wanted. That crowbar is going to bust open so soon. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Boom. What's in here? Oh, I knew it. I knew you'd want me to crowbar one more thing. Maybe there's some food. Oh, hello. Damaged vest, broken assault rifle, broken guitar. Oh. Why do you tempt me so much? Damaged vest sounds lovely. What did we get? Found the electrical part. Good. Oh, we might have to leave the damaged vest here.
nice. Ammunition. Time I come in here to be a faster run. Good man. Get down there. Is there food still in there? Oh, yeah. That's probably what they were talking about. What? You, you can't? That sucks. done the math better. No, no, up here. Right there. Nice. That's only 16. I think we needed more. I think we needed more. Oh, I'm gonna have to leave that vest. Okay, hopefully with that. What is that? That's just 20. 20 materials, 10 wood. Bunch of electronics, we should be able to do that door. And I'll come back for the vest. Nice. That wasn't even that long. Alright, this is where I'm going to cut the, the video for now. And I will see you guys next time. Man, this is turning out to be a really, really awesome, awesome game. It's very addictive. Day 13. Oh, snap. How's everybody? They've been up all night garden. I wish I could bring so much every night. Yeah, buddy. The night was calm. 10-24. Nice. Before everybody gets to uh, doing that other thing, tell me that we've got enough for the reinforced door. Yeah, we totally do. Oh, we would have been able to bring back the vest, too. Bummer. That's awesome. Reinforce that door. Alright, okay, thanks folks. Uh, next time you come back, we're going to reinforce the door and do lots of wonderful things. So thanks so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time on This War of Mine. We're doing pretty good actually. Day 13, happy with my crew. Feeling pretty good. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye!